I didn't think I was gonna have a project this week because my dad came out to visit and at the last minute we decided to kind of put together a quick little project. So I hope you'll cut me some slack on this one. It's an easy project, but we had a lot of fun doing it. This is my dad visiting. His name is Dan Ramsey. He's visiting from Colorado and do you wanna make a project together? I came a thousand miles to make a project. So I got all this pallet wood. You, you wanna try and make something with that? Of course, I've been sawing wood for years. Okay, you all ready to finish it? All set to go. Okay. We're using some water-based polyurethane in an old can that I found that's probably 10 years old, but <laughs> it's working out well. Well, what do you think? I think it'll work. <laughs> now what? Now, hang it on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's still wet. Oh. <laughs> Here I'm wrapping some twine around the frame and holding it down with some hot glue. There's a lot of different ways you can put pictures in a picture frame, but let me show you the really, really easy way that I use. First of all, I almost always use plexiglass rather than glass, mainly because it's easy to cut to size. Pretty. Then I just take my picture and put it in. And you can use cardboard or whatever you have on hand. I have a thin sheet of plywood that I've cut to size. I just take a couple of brads and nail them in. And it doesn't take a lot, just maybe one on each side is plenty to hold it in. I usually just put a couple of eyelets in the sides and then use some picture hanging wire threaded through. One thing to keep in mind if you're making frames is to always try to match the frame to the content of, well, what's inside of the frame and have them sort of go together. In this case, I used an old uh, vegetable crate label from the 1930s and I thought it really fit with the theme really well. So thanks for watching and I want to thank my dad for joining me along in this video and hopefully we'll do another one next time he comes to visit. Be sure and visit my website woodworkingformeremortals.com and where else do they visit me? Oh Facebook, Facebook too and well check the link there's a lot of other in the links and check the links in the description box. <laughs> I need help here. <laughs> All right we'll see you next time. Cheers. <laughs>